Hello, Professor. What brings you here? Fancy a bit of fishing? You know, I can hardly go fishing without thinking of old Gerald. He and I would just sit here, casting our lines again and again. <laughs> I'm no better at it now than I was then. Not a single nibble. Ah, just like your father. You know all the tricks of the fisherman's trade. I was hopeless at it, but he was a master. In the time it took me to catch one fish, he could fill his basket to the brim. You know, talking to you, I'm feeling very nostalgic. Why don't you join me? We can trade some stories about the old man. We spoke before about how Gerald never seemed to age, right? Once, when he was drunk, he let the secret slip. He said he'd had an infusion of crest-bearing blood, and it had greatly extended his life. Well, we'd both been drinking. I, I figured he was joking, so I just laughed it off. Then I asked him his age. He said he'd stopped counting after he hit 100. And he was telling the truth. In those 20 years he was away, he didn't age a bit. An incredible person, to be sure. And I probably don't know the half of it. Actually, I'd, I'd like to ask you something about Gerald, if you don't mind. When Gerald was away from the monastery, what was he like? <laughs> In other words, he was exactly the same. When he was with the knights, he always found time to go fishing. He was hooked on it, you might say. He'd say there was no greater pleasure in life than sinking his teeth into a fish he'd caught and washing it down with a drink. Uh, I have to say, right now, fishing with you, it really takes me back. This feels just like the good old days, when Gerald was sitting alongside me. This is the Great Bridge of Murden, one of the bridges that cuts across the Aramid River between the Empire and the Alliance. Its defenses have been fortified since last I was here. It seems the enemy is sufficiently prepared. Greetings, travelers, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Fire Emblem Three Houses, presented by Draco Breach. I apologize for the long absence there, but maybe you can still hear it in my voice. But I got pretty sick like a uh, really bad sore throat terrible congestion I could not breathe and I could not talk for more than like a minute without coughing so there was pretty much no way that I could record anything even right now I'm afraid that I will cough and my congestion is a lot better but I still do have some congestion going on don't know what it was but uh it actually kind of surprised me, too, getting sick twice in December. So, hopefully that doesn't happen again. But, um, yeah, I'm feeling better now. I wanted to go ahead and try to get this episode out. So, here it is. I don't know when I'll next have a chance to record uh, my Nuzlocke. But hopefully soon. It might not be until... Uh, this weekend, this coming weekend, as in Friday the 10th, I believe, is what Friday is. But, um, actually I can double check that right quick. Yep, the 10th. The 10th might be the next day that I'm able to actually record, um, or stream my Pokemon Nuzlocke. But until then, mm, study now, let's be defensive. Oh, that, I haven't been like that. Prepare ourselves for anything. We must be ready to change our approach. Hanuman, I'm not taking you or Manuela into this battle, so that married couple is out. I do not distrust Claude, but there is no guarantee that the other Alliance lords will not move against us. Onward, with caution. After we cross the Great Bridge, the greatest plains in Fodlin will be before us. You do remember, do you not? I speak of Grander Field, where we fought the battle of the Eagle and Lion. 
The ones defending the Great Bridge. It isn't my father or brother, is it? I really want to finish this battle without seeing them. Especially my father. Yes, I hear your father can fell a bear without even a weapon in hand. When we run into him, I'll be sure to let you take the lead. Family matters and all. That's not funny, you jerk! Should we be burning the signal of uprising? There's no need for that, Petra. Smoke or no smoke, they'll get the idea. Losing the bridge should be a pretty big clue. Oh no, I can't believe we're actually going to invade! If Edelgard gets angry... Oh, I get nervous just picturing it! Stop that imagination! Oh, and if she destroys the monastery with her army, we're all gonna die! The hour of questioning has long since passed. I assure you, whatever happens... Bernadetta and her usual... Five years ago. Imagination running wild. Empire ...was able to focus its entire army on Garrig Mach. Now, their front lines are stretched thin along their borders with both the Kingdom and the Alliance. Their allies have grown in number, but so have their enemies. They should not have too many soldiers they can readily send our way. Now then, let us set forth. This shall be the first step in ending the chaos that has engulfed this realm. Okay, and onward to the bridge. Um, let's see if I can rectify who is not... No, because you're a Gremory right now, if I remember correctly. Yeah, you're fine. Ignaz, I actually got you what I want. Lysithia... I am tempted to go ahead and run her around as a bishop just to get um, renewal because that would be good especially since she's mastered Grimory I think yeah that might be a good idea Leone is fine Sedith is nope Sedith is fine Flane I really would like you to pass this. You have a better chance this time, I think. I think last time you were below. Um, come on. Why can't she pass? Not quite there. Oh, my goodness. Um, Hanneman, not going to waste anything on them yet. Um... Hero is not, so... I might have to wait. I cannot believe Flame is failing. Uh... I don't remember, so I'm going to say no for now. Anna... Anna's weird. Okay. Actually, let's go ahead and not roster. Inventory, reclass, Cyril, no he has not mastered that yet so we're going to leave him there, and time for the Great Bridge Coup, I almost thought that said camp, I don't know why, it clearly says coup, uh, I'm not going to worry about saving, of course. Sights set on Enbar. The resistance army avoids the Agma Mountains, choosing instead to move south along the eastern route that passes through the Alliance. To make it safely through the territory of House Gloucester, supporters of the Empire, the army seeks help from the head of House Regan, Claude. Claude vows to draw away House Gloucester's troops so that the resistance army can advance to the Aramid River, a dividing line. I still think we're going to end up fighting House Gloucester. I need to actually get the Bloodstained after they fix the issues on the Switch. I kind of find it hilarious that they had to rely on Way Forward to uh, fix their programming issues. Thank you 
but WayForward is a very accomplished company, and I do enjoy a lot of their games. Yeah, my voice still feels rough. But this is the first day that I've gotten up. I was like, yeah, I think I can record today. Um, first of all... Okay, Dorothea and Lysithia I both got for Fiendish Blow. So who... Needs Fiendish Blow. Actually, I think I'll just do that. That's fine. Um, map. What do we have going on here? Oh, I recognize you. Shield that grants divine protection from projectiles. No, no. Ooh. Okay, I need a. I need thief in this battle, one hundred percent, because that is worth stealing. Okay, there's a treasure chest. Is there just the one? Kind of looks like it. Okay, so inventory, not items, uh, abilities. Petra swap for that. This is pro. Mm. Mm. No, I'm going to leave Alois out and bring Caspar. Yeah. Then Hunter Leone would be nice to bring along, but oh. Boy, okay. I th think I'll go with this group. No, I'm going to bring Linhart. More healers does not hurt. I think this is the group I want to go with, though. Okay, I only saw the one treasure chest, and I get to it that way. There's a ballista there. I'm going to have to be careful. Oh, there's another treasure chest. Okay. I actually have to rotate the map to see treasure chests. Okay. Just the two. Yeah, that's what it looks like, just the two. Okay. Yes, okay. Um I should be good. Defeat all enemy commanders. Oh, you know what have been what would have been good to actually look. It's an enemy raid. Stay calm and face them head on. Send a messenger to Acheron immediately. If we're quick, we might be able to pull off a pincer attack. That is Lady Slava. She has of late made quite a name for herself as a general. Be on your guard. A pincer attack. That kind of implies a few things. Okay, let's actually look at what everybody has. So I can steal that shield. Is there anything else of note? Master Seal. I have to steal that because it doesn't drop. Okay. Oh! I don't... That's fine. That's fine. I can use I can use that. That's fine. Um You too. Okay. So, convoy. This happens. Um 
I do have keys. Uh, chest keys. Let's take two. Basically, okay. I'm awake. I'm actually kind of surprised that nobody wants to target him, but that is absolutely fine. Okay. What's my strategy? Let's make this quick. I do this for all of us. More fighting. Kind of. Actually, I let's try to. Okay, Caspar definitely has some good strength to him. What is that beast doing? I've had I've asked that a, a, a lot of times concerning um, beasts in the last couple maps, haven't I? They just seem to act weird. Okay. I don't see. I don't see any archers, which is interesting. Cyril, uh, go ahead and. Head, uh, oop, yeah, send that to it. Uh, trying to figure out a good. He doesn't have any three range spells. Okay. I think what I can do is exactly that. Okay. So, we'll start with fire on you, and then Frederick will come over to help basically block things. Maybe this will work? Nope, it's not going to work. Because unfortunately, they're both still targeting... You have a 60% chance to hit, and you have a 57% chance to hit. I think I'm fine. And you can hit with Thoron. While Caspar goes to... I don't know what kind of weapon that is. We will control this fortress if we can eliminate We, we will control this. Interesting. Get the soldiers standing by to join the fight. We may need to hurry up preparations of the ballista too. Protect the fortress. Um, there's only one ballista, if I remember correctly. And I'm having... Arms? You're joking me! I didn't think that being mounted would allow her to use that. Interesting. I'm going to take full advantage of that. Um... May as well take quick advantage of uh, her absurd range and ability to deal damage to armor, despite the fact that really her strength shouldn't allow that. Okay, that... wait, what? 
Who are you people? Now's the time to show your loyalty to the Empire. Attack the enemy from behind. I've got to make my name known to Her Majesty through distinguished service. That is Acheron, a minor alliance noble. If he has allied with the Empire, then we must destroy him. Well, fortunately, they can't move this turn. And you just activated Bernadetta's ability. So now she has permanent she has plus five attack as long as I do not heal her to full. I don't train for fun. Caspar's strength is very good for good good. Good good. I like seeing that speed. Okay, there we go. Fight them yeah, go ahead and challenge Linhart. You think we'll let you take this bridge from us? It appears enemy oh, soldiers are stationed in the fortress. More will come. Stay on your guard. I'm not. Terribly worried about them because Oko. Attack at your own risk. Any more soldiers come out of there, Caspar will just say, you know what, die. Um you No know, Bernadetta. Go ahead and help these guys out. Yes, yes, you are. Because Bernadette is about to Oko you. Hard. I never should have allied with the Empire. Yeah, that was totally worth it. Thank you, Bernadetta. Um Yeah, get out of the way. <laughs> you go after this guy. I'm actually kind of surprised that uh, Fred, uh, Ferdinand's, I almost called him Fred something, I'm not sure what. I'm actually kind of surprised that Ferdinand does not have the speed to, then again, he's not exactly a speedy character, I guess that's more Leone's, um, thing. Okay, you are attacking Lysithia, oh jeez, that's a mistake. If you want to know how big of a mistake it is, well, she just owed so ow, 183 damage. Um, that was unnecessary. That was completely unnecessary, but completely hilarious. Um. His black magic is the lowest skill he has right now. Oh, he gets a counterattack. Oh, that shield looks cool. Okay, um... Oh, there was a tile there that I didn't know about. Yeah, you're not a big threat. That's fine. As long as she doesn't kill you, I'm fine with you attacking. Fire meets water? That's an odd thing to say, but okay. She has a lot of HP. I was kind of hoping to see more strength from her, but I guess Falcon Knights don't have great strength growth. Oh, 
Goodbye reinforcements. Well, you're about to get hurt. Will this ever end? Decided not to go after Lascithia, but then again, considering that she just did like 200 damage, almost 200 damage to somebody, yeah, probably a good idea. Oh, hello. Okay, so you have the Master Seal, so I'm going to steal from you. And you are going to grab this, and then run right back to the other chest. Bernadetta, there is nothing for you there. Okay. No, 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 I'm not going to stand there because that that's within the beast territory. I am going to get people over so I can start taking care of that beast. Uh... I think this, I might actually want to send, oh, um, that might work, actually. How much damage did that do? That did, oh, yeah, okay, I'm gonna need to heal you. That one missed. Okay. You have a Master Seal, but I think you'll join... ...my army without a problem. No, assist. Yeah, Petra needs that, absolutely. Oh, she can't move right now. Uh, these guys are not going to do any damage, so that's not even a problem. You and your javelin could be a problem, but you're, but I don't think I'm in any real danger. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, I think I have a decent force for taking on the monster. Ciro won't be participating because he's going after something else. It's been a while, Professor. If this were anywhere but a battlefield, I would offer you tea. I've no choice but to follow the Empire if I wish to live. I hope you will not think ill of me. Seize the moment. Oh, actually hit. No, no use. Hmm. But he didn't move, so he's still in a lot of danger, so... There's that. Okay, that javelin is... is pretty pointless. Silver Lance. That could have done some significant damage. But you're gone, so yeah, moot point. I love all these criticals. It's insane. I love it. It's great. 
Yeah, it's almost like he didn't do any damage. I can't move. I don't think, and even if he can, I can just... Ooh. Ooh. Rank B authority. Nice. Okay, you're targeting... You have Nosferatu. That's not really a danger. Uh, Cyril? Continue on to that chest, please. Okay. We want to get... Okay, I don't know what happened there. My hand slipped. Uh, we're good here. Lawrence, stop! Please, just stop! Decided not to attack. Don't know why. Wait, who's actually targeting you? That's not a bad thing. Because I can steal and then run. Let's see, just to verify. Okay. Thunder has a higher crit, so let's go with that. Did not end up winning. So... I, the thing is, I don't know if it has to be... If I'm going to take the safe path and only knock him out with... Um, Wait, if I move her, you target someone else. Target Lascithia. That's who I want you to target. Let's actually... You're going to target Lascithia again. Ah, that's fine. While we're at it... That completely heals her rats. Okay, so I can't do that. Not if I want to keep... Talisman, nice. I think that's special defense, so that's going to be useful. Oh, I did not see what she said. Rats. That's going to prevent her from moving, isn't it? That's annoying. But... And level 41. i kind of actually surprised that it goes that high, but at the same time, I'm not. Uh, Persuade. Okay, so... No, I need... Okay, so I'm not close enough there. Is this close enough? Yes, it is. Steal. Yikes. Oh. Well, this is going to be interesting. 
did this monster choose not to That is weird. Okay. Okay, missed that time. I don't want to get rid of the Master Seal, and I definitely don't want to get rid of the Evasion Ring. You are targeting Byleth, not a big deal. Convoy, let's get rid of the training axe and may as well get rid of that while we're here. Wait. Let's make sure that Dorothea can stay close enough to heal them. Okay, we're fine for now. Uh, you are going to be an interesting problem, I do believe. Gambits. Let's see how much of your armor we can get rid of. That should actually do something decent. That works perfectly fine. We'll be able to get this guy's material. Perfectly fine. Oh my goodness, that mask looks weird. I'm guessing that that's what's about to break. Okay. Yeah, I'm not too terribly worried about these guys. And that should be broken armor. And a nearly dead beast. Fire. You're dead. Yeah, you're dead. Today I was lucky. Thank you, Linhart. Nah, you weren't lucky. Ooh, magic. Nothing. Good. Um... Oh, he, he restored some of the magic that he's used. No, don't want to heal Bernadetta just yet. Attacking Violet. I... Rats. Well, I guess that shield is out of... Because that was something that Please forgive the sins of the enemy leaders. The that is something that I could have given to um, any of my flyers. From Petra to um, Cyril to Caspar. Anybody could have really used that. Oh, and Sedith. Possibly Anna and Catherine in the future. To see the Imperial Army hold its ground until every last soldier fell. That is true dedication. It is clear that Edelgard is not some cruel emperor who holds her people in a vice-like grip. There is something more driving our foes. From here on out, our journey will not be an easy one. Excuse me, sir. Gilbert is here. Gilbert? What was he doing all this time? We'd better go and meet with him. So, yeah, he disappeared out of the stronghold at some point, didn't he? I'm impressed that you were able to break through their defenses. Save your praise, Gilbert. Let's get to the heart of the matter. Why are you here? Why now? I am once again in the service of Dimitri. 
He was in hiding in Fraldaria's territory, where he was biding his time for a counteroffensive. Dimitri is alive? Yes, he was to be executed in Ferdiad, but Dadu stepped forward to rescue him. I am here today by command of Dimitri himself. We realize that our enemies are the same, and that it may be advantageous to join forces. I see. I shall hear you out. We are preparing to advance against the Empire. Will you join us as we march toward the Imperial Cap? That is too much to ask. Then at least allow us to freely cross the Great Bridge of Merton. I mean, our goal is the same, but at the same time, I'm kind of worried about what I've seen of Dimitri's personality, so we'll... <laughs> Hold a moment. We have just finished the fierce battle, and our forces are few. To march straight for the main body of the Imperial Army and challenge them? It is too soon. I am happy to allow safe passage over the bridge, but to lend our aid asks too much of us. Is that not so? If you That's probably true. Wait a few months, we might be able to offer something more. I am afraid His Highness is not able to stop his advance. If that is the case, I am afraid we cannot join you. Please send our regards to Dimitri. I understand. It's unfortunate that we were not able to secure the help of the Knights of Seros. Still, I'm grateful that we can cross the Great Bridge of Merton safely. Thank you for that. This will be a fight to the death. It is highly likely that we will meet our end. I wish you both the best of luck in the battles ahead. And may the goddess protect you as well. The whole like set of going, oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. We're kind of drained at the moment. Part two, silver snow, heart string. Makes perfect sense, though. Let's be honest. Fortress. After seizing the Great Bridge of Verdun, the Resistance Army starts making preparations to invade Imperial territory when a surprising piece of information comes to light. Oh. Okay. I have almost everything that I need from the saint statues as far as um, bonus experience gained on uh, on weapons and stuff so Tell us what is the matter. Yes, sir. It seems the kingdom and alliance armies clashed with imperial forces on Grander Field. Amid the chaos of three armies battling each other out there, the imperial army was routed. Edelgard sustained heavy wounds and retreated to Enbar. Well then, I suppose. Sir, the kingdom army was also decimated and His Highness Dimitri has been counted among the dead. What? The Alliance sustained heavy casualties as well, and the whereabouts of their leader, Claude, is currently unknown. Unknown? I... Oh, jeez, really? This is, this is an odd set of choices, and just to go, I'm just going with the first one. Must have been a brutal fight. Our only solace is that Edelgard sustained severe injuries. <sighs> this is all quite unexpected, but we must find a way to use this situation to our advantage. The Empire's main force has suffered a mighty blow. Edelgard will most certainly avoid the front lines. Now is the time for us to infiltrate the Empire and aim for the capital. But 
What will happen to the Lords of the Old Kingdom and Alliance territories? They have lost many leaders and soldiers. I'm sure they must be hard at work rebuilding. We will foster cooperation by aiding them through the local churches. The remaining Lords of the Kingdom and Alliance must join together to form one union. And you should be the one to lead them. What do you say? In time, I can't decide that. Oh, jeez. Indeed, hmm, flame we like that. For another day, we must focus on our battle with the Empire. For now, what is our next course of action? Oh, said it like that. We must choose a place within the Empire that will give us solid defenses for our front line. That will become the foothold for our invasion of the capital. There is one massive fortress that boasts the greatest defenses in the Empire, Fort Mercius. We will stand no chance if we attack by traditional means. We must gather everyone and devise a plan of attack. It has been a lifetime, hasn't it, Professor? Yes, I thought so too. I wanted to slice her throat, but I did not get the chance. I let people die, and yet I still stand. Rodrig, Gustav, to do. You can still atone for your sins. Interesting. You sound just like Rodrigue. Reason. Everyone gives such complicated advice, and I can never quite grasp it all. That is why, Professor, I came here to explain my decision. I have no resources to take back the Kingdom Capital, much less to defeat the Empire. And that is why... Professor? You will catch a cold sleeping in a place like this. Is he actually dead and that was a dream, or...? Hmm? I am the only one here. Were you dreaming? I can't say for certain that you were dreaming. But if someone did come here to see you, that person only wanted you to see their face. Perhaps they wanted you to guide them. Odd circumstances. But anyway, that looks like it's going to be it for today. Although, let's face it. Come on, Flane. Mon Flame. Yes, okay. I have succeeded. Finally, finally, okay. That's pretty much everybody that I care about. But for the time being, this will be Draco Breach reporting out. God bless and safe travels.